Hi guys, well it's been a while since I've been out so I've decided to come out to yet again another familiar location that I've visited uh, quite a few times on the channel and it was of course the first place where I did my first uh, uh, walk here for the channel which is up at Overton Estate. Now the purpose of today is not to get your typical snapshots or typical shots just around the area because I've already done plenty of that. Now today is uh, I'm trying something a little different which is an experimental type of photography. The photography I'm referring to is ICM. Now for those of you who don't know, ICM stands for Intentional Camera Movement, which is basically where you purposefully move your camera, whether it be a kind of vertical pan or a kind of horizontal pan. Yeah, so by doing this it creates a kind of interesting abstract image for the viewer to look at. And uh, yeah, so that's what I'm going to try and go for here up at the Overton Estate. Because there's plenty of trees and foliage that I can use as a subject to try and uh, capture this technique. It's also something I've never given a go before, so yeah, I think I'm going to have some pretty hit and miss results today. That's just uh, the nature of it, you've just got to experiment and try and get your settings right. And uh, yeah, so obviously that's what I'll be doing today, is uh, just getting a feel for the ICM uh, as a technique and uh, yeah, just see how it go. Well, I've taken a walk up a little pathway and I've taken one or two wee shots on the way um, just kind of experiment and getting one or two wee flowery shots and I've stopped by uh, an area that's actually got uh, some tall trees so the trees are just behind me there so I might use this as my first um, proper experiment with the ICM just to see how it goes so. Oh yeah, and today I'm using my Olympus EM1 Micro Four Thirds camera to capture the shots I've taken many shots so far and I've tried to experiment with different subjects, just uh, things like ferns and also sorts of other um, plants and flowers that are actually grown here as well. I've been trying to, you know, experiment with vertical and uh, horizontal compositions and also, you know, I've been trying turning the camera quickly and then turning it a bit slower. Yeah, I'm trying to keep it, keep the shutter speeds relatively long so that we, you know, can try and get the kind of blur effect and try and keep something like say the fern in focus or like one of the flowers in focus or try and obviously create a kind of blurred effect of the you know of the tree trunks you know or you know so that's the kind of thing i'm trying to go for and so far i think the results are very hit and miss <laughs> i think it's gonna be very hit and miss so yeah but uh, yeah i'll be still interested to get home and take a look at these images and just see how they turn out so yeah Anyway, before I finish up, I'm going to move on to another subject that's up here. It's a kind of a funny shaped triangular monument. Uh, it's a kind of actually a plaything for kids, I think, and it's actually just further up the hill from where I am. So I might try and do that as an ICM shot. Yeah, because I think it could be quite interesting to see how this one works out. Uh, it's certainly an interesting looking object, so for uh, taking pictures of, so I think it might be quite good for ICM as well. I don't know, but we'll see. I have to say, that's good advice. Okay, that just about wraps up for the video guys. Hope you've enjoyed this one. It's certainly something very different from what I've tried before on the channel. I think the results are going to be pretty hit and miss, I think that has to be said. <laughs> yeah, some of the images have a kind of, kind of eye-catching quality, whereas uh, quite a few of the other images, has to be said, don't. <laughs>
But yeah, as I said, I mean, this is the first time I've tried this sort of thing, so the results are definitely going to be very, very mixed. So uh, you're just going to have to, you know, take what you can get when you actually do it. The settings I used exclusively today were I used uh, shutter priority for all these shots, you know, and I just kind of, as I said, experimented with my shutter speeds and tried to um, keep them fairly slow. Uh, I think I went no faster than, say, Tw uh, 25th of a second. Oh well, yeah, just to mention, all these shots were taken handheld. I didn't use the tripod for any of them. So, okay. So thanks again for watching, guys. Also, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. And there's plenty of other content and things on there to have a look at. And I will see you in the next one. So until the next one, this is Kenny from Overton Estate signing off. Bye for now.